Hello students, I'm here again with my next video on trends in world population growth. Well, I'll be explaining this with the help of this graph. This graph indicates the increasing trends in world population growth with increasing resources and technology. As we know that the present population of the world is uh, 7.8 billion. It took centuries to grow to this size. In this graph, x-axis indicate the time period. On the y-axis, it is the population in billions. Each division on y-axis is indicated as 1 billion. Well, for a long period, the population growth of the world was very slow. But during last few hundred years, it has grown at an alarming rate. As we see that, about 12,000 to 8,000 years ago, man learned to grow crops and live in small settlements, generally around the river banks. At that time, the population was small and was roughly 8 million. That means 80 lakhs. You all know that 1 million is equal to 10 lakhs. In the first century AD, the population was less than 300 million. Then, 1400 to 1600 AD was the age of European explorations and colonization. They discovered new lands and resources leading to expansion of population. Now, around 1750, in the beginning of the Industrial Revolution, the world population was just 550 million. That means more than half a billion, little more than half a billion. You all know that 1 billion is equal to 1000 millions. The booming of Industrial Revolution led to the rapid increase in the world population. In other words, this was the time of population explosion. It continued for about two centuries. That is, it started from 1750 AD and continued till 1950 AD. During this period, there were lot of improvements in transportation, sanitation and health and medical facilities which led to the control on the spread of diseases. Consequently, in a very short period, the death rate decreased to a large extent. Therefore, high rate of survival led to the increase in population. Then we talk about the biotechnology. Biotechnological innovations resulted in a number of innovations or inventions, such as Invention of many new medicines saved more sick people, which led to the increase in population. Secondly, the high yielding variety seeds brought revolution in the field of agriculture, resulting in more food production in the world. In this way, life and food security led to the increase in world population. Technological advancements also helped in the reduction of death rate and they provided a stage for increasing population growth. One thing can be noticed here that in this whole period all efforts were made to control the death rate and to save the people from diseases but there was no thought given to control the birth rate. This resulted in high population growth rate. Now visualize this bar graph. It provides an additional perspective on population growth. That is, the number of years it took to add every 1 billion to the global population. It shows that how the population growth has changed dramatically through time. It was for the first time in 1830 that the world reached its first billion. It then took another hundred years to reach two billion in 1930. By the third billion, this period had reduced to 30 years in 1960. It reduced further in 15 years to reach four billion. Well, the period of fastest growth occurred between 1975 
to 2011. During this period, after every 12 years, there was an increase of 1 billion. The good thing is that the world has now surpassed the peak rate of growth and the period between each billion is now expected to rise. According to United Nations, it is estimated to take approximately 14 years to reach 8 billion in the year 2025. We already know that at present in the year 2020, population has reached 7.8 billion. So, as per the estimates, in 2025, it will hit 8 billion. Now see the visualization again and let's talk about the doubling time of the world population. Doubling time of the population is the period of time required for a country to double its population. World population took more than a million years to attain 1 billion mark in the year 1830. But it took only 100 years for the population to rise from 1 billion to 2 billion. That doubled in 100 years, 1 billion to 2 billion. Then from 2 to 4 billion, it took 45 years. And to reach from 4 billion to 8 billion, it will take 50 years. If you see the bar carefully, you will find that the doubling time of the world population is reducing fast till 1975. Now, the doubling time of the world population will keep on increasing. Now, if we talk about the doubling time of population among different regions, then we will find that there is a great variation. The developed countries take more time to double their population as compared to the developing countries. So, we can say that the population in developing countries is exploding. The growth of population is low in developed countries as compared to the developing countries. Well, students, there is a negative correlation between economic development and population growth. This means that economic development is inversely related to population growth. This means that economically developed countries have put deliberate efforts in controlling their population growth. On the other hand, the economically less developed or developing countries have high growth rate. I believe you understand this topic and in the next video I will meet you with the next topic, the demographic transition. Thank you very much.